Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. I am here to do a couple of unboxings with you today and I'm very excited because I have actually had these, actually three boxes here for a week or so now and I've been dying to open it but I wanted to film the unboxing. I love watching unboxings so if you like that as well, continue to watch. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Emily and I love handbags. I also love fashion, travel, luxury. So if you like any or all of those things, consider subscribing and hitting the notification bell so that you'll be notified of my upcoming and future videos. If you've seen my previous unboxing video, I was pretty into fall. So I think the two boxes here, I don't know if you can see both of them, are kind of continuations of that. Um, and then I also have a very exciting Dior limited edition item to share with you as well. So let's get started. I'm going to go ahead and start with these ones here. I, I'm just going to bring them up so you can see both of them. These are both very cool looking boxes. Um, you might be able to tell from the shape of them, but they are shoes. Um, you know I really like shoes. I've been reviewing a lot of them. I've also been looking for a uh, comfortable, sustainable, you know, multi-use type of styles. So um, they were sitting right here. So I'm just going to get right into it and I can tell you a little bit more about this brand. So this is from the brand Vivaya and it was for full disclosure sent to me to review. I did pick these out myself, but my opinions are going to be my honest feedback for you. It's always been that way. So yeah, I just want to put that out there, but let's see what I selected. They have so many different items on their website and it was hard to just pick two, but I'll share more styles with you, but let's just look at these ones first. So they come like this wrapped really nicely. Um, let me take out the other one. You can see the box is actually very small, so they are very conscious of um, their footprint. They advertise being a sustainable and eco-friendly company. There is a card here that came with the shoes and it's shoe care. Um, it says don't dry clean, don't bleach, dry in the shade and wash in cold water. So that's really cool. Um, so there they are both here. Let me just remove these things here. There go. So those are the things that hold it in, sh in shape. Wow, look at, it matches my blazer perfectly today. So I probably will wear these out today. Um, I'll be inserting some photos in just a bit, but um, just take a look at these. These loafers are the cutest thing. Look at the little bow. You know I love bows, um, but look at that. It is beautiful. The bottom is like this rubbery um, material so you won't slip. And look at this, watch this. Look how flexible that is. It's so flexible, it's so soft, and it'll just mold to your feet. Also, like I just read from the card, this is washable, so it is beautiful. If it gets dirty, you can wash it and it'll be beautiful again. So yeah, I am so excited to start wearing these. These you can like definitely wear to work. I can see myself wearing the this pair of shoes to work. I can also see myself wearing it to a more dressy evening, but not wearing heels because yeah, and because I picked it in such a neutral color, I think it'll go with many outfits. Although there was this really cute pink one that I might be looking at, but yeah, this is a beautiful. I will link this below. I'm so excited. So just a little bit about Vivaya before I unbox uh, the second pair. It is, as you see, a knitted 3D technology that they in, that they use to avoid extra waste. There is no seam on this pair of shoes, which is really cool because that means there's no uh, fabric that they have to cut out. They basically make it to this shape exactly. So the material that this comes from is actually, to make this pair of shoes, is actually six plastic bottles that they grab from either the ocean or, you know, city waste. So even the starting material is already removing things from our waste to be recycled. But in addition, they don't create more waste because they only make what they need. So that is really, really amazing. I have just tried these on and they are so comfortable. They bend with my foot. They also have a lot of cushion, even though it's not very th a thick sole. Um, they have these removable inserts. They also have accessories that you can buy. So uh, the inserts are one of them, but they also have bows. Say you have bought a more plain flat and you wanted to dress it up. They also have 
have accessories that you can clip on to your shoes to make them look cute and like versatile. Um, this one's already attached on, but in I just want to point that out in case you wanted to check it out. I will also be putting a few more shoes that I really am liking and I wanted to get also in either linked below or I'll pop them onto the screen here. They have anything from like boots, sandals, um, mules, I don't know, like, like the obviously loafers, flats. They just have so many different options. They also even have men's shoes. So um, not all of them, I just want to point it out, not all of them are washable. This pair is, but they'll list it on the website. So definitely take into account of that. If you want a pair that is washable, make sure you pick one that is. Um, but they have so many options. Let me get to the next pair because I... I'm, I'm excited. All right, here we go. Another pair from Vivaya. They really make really fashionable and chic styles, so I'm glad I found out about them. Oh my god. Okay, let me take both of them out first so you can see them better. So, here we go. Let me remove, again, they come pre-stuffed with this cardboard piece. All right, so here is the second pair. Again, my bows, because you know I love them, but this one has a little cap toe and has a little like V shape over there. It just makes it so stylish. It elongates your legs as well. So this pair is something that I was really excited to try. And it is a kitten heel. As you can see, there's like a little bit of height for a petite gal like me. Every little inch helps. So having an extra inch here is definitely um, a plus for me. And this is the side of this. So there is a slight logo right here. It has the V for Vivaya. And there we are. It also does have the non-slip base right here. This one also comes in a black color. So if you like something a little bit more, you know, um, darker, they also have that option. But I just, I've just been on a, like a beige brown kick. So I chose these ones. And yeah, I don't know if I showed you this on the last pair, but there's this really cool cushion piece right here on the heel. So it does really help with, you know, comfort. Like I was saying, these shoes are stylish, but they're also very comfortable. So it, they've taken everything into account. This pair is not washable, but you can spot clean it. I believe the reason why, I didn't read it on the website why, but from my thinking, it's just because this heel, like if you wash it in the washing machine, it could get damaged, but the knit feels exactly the same as the loafers, so I can't imagine why you cannot wash it. So you can definitely hand, um, you know, wipe it clean. Um, so I'm hoping that these don't get dirty because they are a lighter color, but I'm hoping that I could spot clean it if needed. This one also does not have the removable liner. I don't know if you remember the loafer pair. So I think that's also another reason why you can't wash it because you can't separate it. There is like probably glue um, that keeps it down but yeah this one is also very flexible not as flexible as the loafer pair but you can see like you can bend it very easily so it will help with walking on heels i am so happy with these two pairs these are great for the fall i think they'll transition nicely from spring to fall um i don't know about the winter i don't know how warm these are but i will try them out and let you know i do have a promo code for you i don't make anything off of it but i will share it with you so that you can save some money the promo code is angel and 15 and I'll put it here and also in the description box below along with the link. Some of them are on sale so definitely take advantage of it and a big plus I want to say is that these shoes do ship for free if you buy $99. They do have a 30-day global free return exchange policy in case it doesn't fit you well. I did measure my foot personally before purchasing and they have a great like chart table that tells you what size you should wear. Just for reference um, I usually am a six six and a half in US women's size. I did get both of these in a six and a half because I believe I read that they say to go up half a size. So that's what I did. But like look at look at your measurements look at you know how the fit is on your foot it doesn't just look at the length of your feet but also the width and like the circumference of, of your foot so it does look at multiple things so definitely check it out and let me know if you get anything or if you already have a few pairs from Vivaya I would love to know.
All right, so moving on to the second half of the video, and that is the Dior unboxing. It is extremely heavy. It is in this box. I love the bow. It's so cute. It's so pretty. I can never tie. I try to retie this, so I, I cannot. So <laughs> I could not open this box and like re like retie it for you. So we're doing this ac an actual unboxing here. So ready. I love. Dior packaging. It's so pretty. So it comes in this white box with the Dior writing in gold. Love their little sticker right there. Let's see if I can open it. All right, here we go. There's not as much padding in this one that I've seen before, but let's go, let's start with this little baggie. This baggie is um, one that I usually get from Dior and it is just a pouch full of their goodies uh, samples. So I got a little one of the Le Micro Serum, the Rose for Eyes, Oud Ispahan. Um, I'm not sure if I've smelled this one. Actually, I think I've smelled this one before. Got a little squished, but these are like miniature, that was a miniature perfume. Oh my gosh, I love these. these. This is a miniature perfume as well, but you can see that it's just like a little glass. It's Amber Nuit. I love these ones. They look so pretty on the vanity. That's a gift that you get if you spent over a hundred dollars. And then another um, miniature uh, perfume spray. This one is Bois d'Argent. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it correctly, but it's a usual, like very small, I think this is like a two mil uh, sample. So great for purses. I have two Capture Total. It's the eye serum. Oh, one's an eye serum, one's just a regular serum for your face. So these are great for travels. So I also love these pouches. These are like the cotton material with a Dior written on it. So they're great for if you just want a little pouch to put in your purse without taking too much space. And yeah, draw a string and close. So getting back to what I had actually purchased, I don't know if you can already see, but there are some beautiful packaging. Look at that. This whole set that I purchased here is from the Millefiori line of beauty that was originally created by uh, Maria Grazia Chiuri, and she had designed these patterns, but they've created a beauty line from it since. So I'm just gonna open it for you to show you what I got. Oh, I can smell it already. I just opened the first flap here. So. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. <laughs> this is so cute. So let me bring this closer. There we go. This is the first piece and it is a Miss Dior candle in the Millie Fiori print. So this is a kind of ceramic, I think porcelain container. And um, there's a little thing that it goes on top of it, but look at how beautiful that is. It is rather small. I don't know if you can see just by me holding it in my hand. It is rather small. I, let me just tell you the size. Does it say? It is three ounces, so it's not big, but it's it smells amazing. And I love that after I finish using it, I can definitely repurpose this to, uh, I don't know, hold Q-tips or something like that. I'm not sure yet, but it's beautiful. If you like the Miss Dior scent, you would love this piece. All right, so the next item I have here is again in the same Millie Fury floral packaging. This little sticker came off. And let's see. I was actually kind of surprised that they came out with this line right now. It's available on, I believe, multiple retailers, but I, it just feels like more of a springtime piece. So here it is, and so as you can see, these are micro beads um, in a glass jar. It is, again, the Miss Dior fragrance, and yeah, it is the bath pearls they called it and let me see if i can just so there's like a little container here i don't want to spill the beads you can see different size pearls but you put these in the bath and they create a scented bath oh my gosh they smell so good 
so I can't wait to use these. Um, gotta take advantage of the warm, warm-ish weather before it gets too cold to take a bath, but it smells so wonderful. So I have to read the directions on how to, uh, or how much to use, because obviously like there's not a lot in here, but I still want a good scented bath. So excited. It goes really well with a candle. I'll just like light that and bathe in this. All right, so the last item is here. It is not in the Millefiori packaging, but it is part of the line, so I'm excited to see. It does say here, uh, limited edition Millefiori, so you can tell. This is their Forever Cushion Powder, which they do come out with in the regular line, and sometimes they do come out with it like in limited edition packaging, so this is one of them. I'm sorry, just... Ta-da! Wow. So here we are. This is the Millie Fiori print that you've seen before, but now it's on the top of this cushion powder container. It's very similar to their other uh, Forever Cushion powders, and you open it like this. There's a mirror on that side, and so this is like a little powder puff, and then this is, if you open this, that's how you get into the cushion powder. So it's a loose powder. This one has a no no coloring. It's just like a, a clear one. So yeah, it's beautiful. And these uh, powder containers are refillable, I believe. Um, at least in the past they have been. So I'm going to look into that. And if it's refillable, then you can always put in, buy a uh, replacement and put it back in here. So you can always have this design. It's beautiful, isn't it? Ugh. So pretty. They also have lipstick covers. They have, I believe, some little macaroon bath bomb things. They're so beautiful. I will link them below. I think the your website have been having trouble like when I search for it or when it links. So I will actually put links below to to go to the exact page because otherwise you get like a, a dead end. I don't know, it's weird. Dior Beauty's website have been a little off lately. I don't know if you guys had the same experience, but sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Anyway, so I will include all three of these pieces that I got from Dior below, as well as additional items from the Millie Fiori line, which I love. By the way, I just saw yesterday that they also have this new holiday collection item. It, every year they do one. I got one last year, it was in gold. This year it's in the black lacquer material and it has the same thing it has a menagerie and it also has a lipstick attachment so you can wear it on the chain with both as like sort of a shoulder bag or you can wear the clutch on its own or you can wear the lipstick holder as a necklace on its own and it comes with lipsticks so it's beautiful it is more expensive this year but they do sell out so i will link it below as well if you're interested and jump on it because it will sell out i just know that if you want a piece of dior without buying some of their handbags which is a lot more expensive this is a really good option especially for the holidays where you just need to put a lipstick and like your id or some cash and cards this is the perfect piece if you remove all the lipsticks from it i just want to show you mine what i mean this is the gold one and and if you open it, there's a mirror on the bottom, but there's three lipsticks here, but you can remove this lipstick case. And then when you do that, you can put your ID or cards in here. And on this side, this is the lipstick. So if you did want to still bring a lipstick, you can, and it goes into this lipstick holder. And uh, there is a chain that attaches on here, along here, and so you can wear it. But you can also remove that. So like this, you can wear this lipstick separately as a necklace here, or you can wear this as a clutch because it only now only has this side and you can wear as a clutch. This is a really cool Dior piece without buying Dior bag prices and it's very chic as well. Oh, and this is the chain that it comes with. So yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed all of these unboxings. If you grabbed anything, let me know in the comments below if you liked it. I would love to know your thoughts. Also, if you wanna see outfits of the shoes that I just unboxed, visit me on my Instagram at clutch to carry all and yeah, you'll see what it looks like in the wild. <laughs> I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Check the links below, check the discount codes below, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.